Guys, we have some bullish price action and news come in for Pepe. And I wanna break it down in this important video. So we're gonna be talking about some big whale moves that have happened recently. And also what is the Pepe price doing? Where can it go in the future? And importantly, what else is happening in the crypto market that you should definitely be aware of right now in the crypto market so you can best prepare yourself for what is to come. That's exactly what we're gonna be talking about in this special update for Pepe. So if you guys enjoy it, make sure to subscribe to the channel. And also if you wanna get some of the best trading bonuses literally in the whole entire crypto market right now make sure to go check out uh, jump x right here in the description of this video so you can get up to a hundred thousand dollars worth of bonuses but they are tiered depending on how much trading volume you can do so you can actually unlock plenty of bonuses on the lower tiers right here and this is an exclusive benefit for you guys who are followers of this channel so make sure to use the special link in the description you can unlock that if you're into active trading in the crypto market so going long and short on pepe or even it could be bitcoin as well we'll talk about that later on in this video but link in the description of this video right here and guys let's talk about what's happening with pepe because things have been looking good we have pushed back to around 3.5 billion dollars in market capitalization this is good so we're getting closer and closer back up in price and you can actually see right here even though this is a very long-term window you can see we've actually climbed pretty nicely from this level and we've actually punched into the 8.2 so if we actually zoom in right here on this level very acutely you can actually see we have been bouncing super nice from around the 7th of September so you can see right here on this graph 7th of September we actually hit a local low in this zone for the crypto so we actually were trading at around five zeros and a six three level at this zone but you can see we have pushed up pretty nicely slight retracement right here but big news uh pushing pepe up and we've actually climbed all the way back back up to five zeros and an eight level right now so we have uh, pushed up pretty nicely in terms of price action and what has been a big driver of this just recently is what's happening with the whale so you can actually see right here pepe whale scoops up 1.3 million us dollars worth despite the volatility that is happening and they could there potentially be another big uptrend coming in for pepe right now so this person has scooped up around 160 billion worth of pepe and this is good so we have more bullish whales coming in for this crypto could there potentially be more bullish uptrends coming through for pepe i think there's a good case to say there is a good chance of that right now because we are sitting at 5082 if we have a look right here at the all-time price for pepe you can see on a very long-term price window right here, you know, February 2024, this is when things really kicked off for this crypto. Slight retracement, the all-time high we're targeting to looking to recapture is gonna be 4017 at this level. And uh, that's gonna be, you know, the big medium-term, you know, price target to capture. But I think, you know, new ones to really contest, new ones to really break out. We're looking at the nine level, uh, the 10 level is also going to be very important for Pepe at around this zone if we can push through that. And then again, the next level of resistance is going to be this level right here where we were tested previously. So we're looking at around the 12 level. So 9, 9 10, 12. And then it might be off to the races to try and you know capture this all-time high and then break through the all-time high. And before we talk about what could potentially cause more of that price action to the north side, let's talk about some critical news you guys should be aware of right now in the crypto market. First of all, SEC approves options for BlackRock's spot Bitcoin ETF. And this is good. So we want to see more of this happen in the future. More spreading of uh, Bitcoin and crypto adoption in the financial markets. I think this is a good sign for us. And we want to see more of this. And if we actually jump to the Bitcoin price right now, we are starting to, you know, look pretty solid on ter in terms of Bitcoin. So I've also got another very long term price window here for Bitcoin. And again, you know, we're still in this zone. So we're in this contested battle box zone for Bitcoins. So we have to break out of this eventually. $73,000 is the all time high for Bitcoin. And guys, we're not very far away from this at all. So we're actually trading around $63,000 today, which is Sunday, 22nd of se uh, September. And uh, if we can just push through this, this would be good. But if you have a look right here, this is a nice uptrend for Bitcoin. So we're trending upwards uh, on the macro scale of Bitcoin price movements right here. And have a look at this news as well. SEC cracking down on Elon Musk and X. So big political Game of Thrones actions happening for Twitter. 
an ex Elon Musk. Not to be surprised though, because Elon Musk has completely changed how Twitter operates. So the Twitter's a great ground, uh, place for uh, crypto. I'll be honest with you guys. Plenty of fresh alpha. Just go check out uh, plenty, plenty of great info getting shared around on X. But have a look at this. Gary Gensler looking to investigate, looking to potentially you know harass x twitter elon musk you know make them pay fines fees etc and i think this has nothing to do with crypto this is just pure politics so this is a political play they just don't like what elon musk has been doing on twitter and remember twitter has changed it is not like it was before you can say a lot of things on twitter now and uh, it's a place of uh, freedom of speech that is for sure i would say right now so the town square and that's why elon musk bought it up remember he spent like 40 plus billion dollars on twitter and he did it from a political point of view. That was That's my opinion on the matter. But that is some new data we've had uh, coming out for the political landscape. And this is going to tie into later this year as well. So there is a tie into crypto and it's got to do with you know Donald Trump, the USA election. And again, that could be a big Q4 catalyst to watch out for, you know, somewhere around here. So can we see, you know, a big pro crypto president come to power in USA? That is also going to be another important thing to definitely have it on the radar, you know, as this journey unlocks in the crypto market right there. So some big political news. And also as another, you know, definitely price potential catalyst for Pepe is this, and that is going to be whether Michael Saylor buys up more Bitcoin. So we have had a recent $458 million buy up of Bitcoin. If we get more of that, that's going to push up the Bitcoin price, and that will also send up the rest of the crypto market uh, in the crypto space. So again, you have a look at the crypto market today. You know What we want to see is we want to see Bitcoin going way up in terms of price. We want to see the rest of the cryptos pump, and then we want to see you know Pepe capture that. And I think in terms of other catalysts for Pepe, we're talking you know other people new new investors coming into the crypto market seeing pepe as a fun crypto adding it to their portfolio as first-time holders that would definitely potentially increase the price of pepe and uh, also you know could coinbase list it plenty more colors coming up for uh, pepe and you have to remember you know i do benchmark pepe against cryptos like ship and doge if you actually have a look at doge i mean doge is 15 billion dollars and this has got nothing but meme power community power behind it for 15 billion dollars and that could just be a nice price target for us in the immediate term as well so that would be a 5x for pepe but again long term if things go absolutely crazy in the crypto market maybe pepe can get 50 billion let me know in the comment section below if you think that can potentially happen because again we've seen doge go to 80 billion we've seen shib go to 40 billion and anything can happen with these meme coins guys so high reward high risk just the way i like it and if you guys like these updates make sure to subscribe and also if you guys want some very nice i think it's probably the best trading bonuses on a crypto exchange at the moment go check out uh jump x right there in the description of this video so if you're actively trading on in crypto you may as well accumulate the bonuses link in the description of this video right here but guys that's a very fresh update we're gonna be checking out lots of very exciting high reward high risk meme coins right here on this channel if that sounds like something you're interested in you can join me and subscribe but really appreciate you tuning in have a good weekend and i'll see you guys in the next video crypto zeus signing out